Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and uh, I have some big news to talk about here. So, um, there's going to be uh, some new cookies that will be coming into Cookie Run Kingdom. So yeah, this is going to be quite a long video because I have to show a lot of stuff. So, um, so there's this like weird like con candy crab here. Not con candy, dang it. It was, it's, uh. It's candy corn crab, not cotton candy crab. Like, what am I saying? Uh, I don't that I don't that wasn't there in Cookie Run Kingdom before, so I could be an update. And then this is like Peach Cookie, I think. Uh, she's from Owen Break, so she might come to Kingdom too. And then these are like the uh, chess cookies. Uh, they're also coming, which is really nice. And um, there's a Blossom Cookie, which she will come in Cookie Run Kingdom on the spring update. And then Moonlight Cookie will come to, uh, to Cookie Run Kingdom 2. And, um, and then, uh, I forgot what this Fire Cookie's name is. Uh, apparently this is what the, uh, gotcha thing is supposed to look like, which is pretty cool. Well, the logo is just Pancake Cookie, pretty cute. And then there's, I think this is, why do I keep forgetting the names? This is so stupid. Um... I think this is like wind something. I don't, wind archer cookie, I think, since it says wind archer on the bottom. He's just staring at the lake. He's just chilling. And it's another leaf from the pan cute pancake cookie logo. He's just staring at the poison lake. He better not be going in there because he, he would be dead meat if he went in this. I don't know why in the heck he's just staring at the lake, but whatever. Okay, now I'm going to show you some more stuff. So yeah, here are some of her like sprite things. Like that. It's like her idol thing, and that's probably what she's gonna do when she's doing she's like at the coins and whatever. And um there's this um it says springtime in Cookie Run Kingdom. Notice something particular, I think that's what it says. Cherry cookie, all the cookies, has grown a huge tear cherry tree. That's a lot of cookies to just grow one tree. <laughs> uh don't you wonder what who else springtime might bring? And when you go to the image, like, down, it leads to that. It, it, it's nice. It, it's a cool aesthetic image. So, yeah. I don't know if it's really aesthetic, but it looks beautiful. So, but where are all the cookies, though? Where do they go? Did they just leave her here because they hate her so much? I honestly don't know. That's obviously a joke. I don't think they hate Cherry Cookie. But... Who knows? Maybe they do. Maybe they canonly hate her. Who knows? I, I honestly, I honestly don't know. Look, it says Cherry Blossom on there. So, bl 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 Blossom Cookies definitely, Blossom Cookies, de uh, Cherry Blossom is definitely coming to Cookie Run Kingdom. So, I have to show you more things, so good luck. So, guys, there's actually, like, the cookies, like, gotcha thing, and there's actually, like, their voice, too, so... Are you serious? Why? Why did you just have to put an ad? Okay, whatever. Sorry, it's like, why is it in low quality? Just do it normal. It always happens to me, okay? Are you truly awake? Yeah, pretty cool. Um, so. Now let's go to Wind Archer Cookie. Oh, come on. Are you serious? Okay, there you go. My arrow shall purify the darkness. Okay, that, that right there, the English VA is actually Kellen Goff, the one who uh, uh, voiced Runtime Freddy and Molten Freddy and more characters. But in my opinion, it just doesn't suit Wind Archer Cookie for me. It just doesn't. I mean, I'm not saying he's bad. I'm just saying, like... My arrow shall purify the darkness. He just... He kind of sounds like... He kind of sort of sounds like a little bit of a grandpa. Just a little bit. It, it's not, like, horrific. Like, I can't watch it or listen to it. But it doesn't really suit him really well. Oh, and also... And there's fire spirit cookie. Why does it keep putting it to the lowest quality? I am the fire. 
Yeah, that that actually that actually suits him this time. Um, that could be like Chili Pepper's brother or something. Even though he's not. Even though he's not. And this this is White Lily's voice, which is kind of obvious because we heard her in like the stories. But I just want to show you guys anyway. I must learn the truth. So basically, this means that like White Lily or and Dark Enchantress Cookie are like separate. Ex like um, I really don't know if like Dark Enchantress and White Lily are the same cookie. I honestly really don't know. Uh, I know she got in like some sort of like pit of like evil stuff or something. I really don't know. And then, this is Dark Enchantress. Stop putting it on the lowest quality. I don't have stupid Wi-Fi, so why do you keep doing it? I must I must take it off of auto mode because I can't do this, but it's recommended, so. Do not resist your temptation. That sounds like a grandma to me. <laughs> sounds like a grandma. She sounds like she's like she's like uh she's like uh she's like uh like 80 years old or something. And there's this one. My roots spread far and wide. Bruh, at first I thought that cookie was a girl <laughs> until I saw that. I was like, what? And then there's, there's of course. Okay, let's just move on. Let's pretend that this ad is nothing. Okay, alright. Um, and for all you Golden Cheese Simpson fans. Meet Golden Cheese Cookie. You finally get to hear her voice and see her gotcha thing and whatever. Alright. All that shines belongs to my kingdom. And that, that's just her. I, the music is just so questionable. Um. Yeah. Okay. So. Um. There, this is like her walk cycle. The music is so questionable yet so good. So um, now I'm gonna give you something else. So this is the this is one more thing. This this is the last thing I promise. So uh, for the last thing I'm gonna be talking about, there's gonna be new costumes, which is extremely cool. And Parfait Cookie finally gets a costume. Jeez, like it's about time for her to get a costume. So, yeah, I think it's gonna be picnic related too. Uh, it's gonna be like spring related. I wonder what the summer update's gonna be. They're probably gonna add like some sort of summer cookie. Oh, maybe like soda cookie or something. But they, since he's like a surfer and you know surfing summer, you know. Um. So yeah, I, I love the costume. And then there's Devil Cookie's costume. He's pretty cool. I love how he just has like an evil bunny, <laughs> an evil bunny, cotton candy that just is angry. And then there's espresso. There's espresso cookie. Now he can finally try to um uh be a better like be a better cookie and maybe and he looks more like royal so maybe like Madeline might like it or something. Um and no this is not some sort of Madeline espresso ship. I I don't really ship them. Not because it's like not not because I'm homophobic. It's just because like I just don't ship them because they like have a library between each other or something. I wonder what Madeline is gonna think of this of this costume. He's probably gonna say something in like a story thing. I honestly don't know. But maybe he might impress Madeline. Or maybe the espresso might impress him. I don't know. I I don't know understand what why I just said that. Please don't question it. But um yeah, that's pretty much it. This video is very long, but and it's already 12 a.m. So yeah. Uh anyway, uh I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe. Yeah. I will do I will do a Cookie Run Kingdom gameplay on this probably because. The reason why I didn't do Cookie Run Kingdom gameplays after the, like the last one was the the April old update was because my OBS had a problem and I finally learned how to fix the problem. So I just do use the display thing and it fixed everything. Even though when you exit off, it's just like crazy. But I I I don't care. I don't care. At least it fixed the problem. 
But uh, yeah, that's it. So thank you guys for watching. Bye.